So behind me is where we're going to be searching and as you can see there's like six seven foot concrete walls so whatever's been dropped in there nobody's going down to get it except for me and Jake so <laughs> we can find anything in there today. Wait drop a thumbs up if you guys are enjoying these urban treasure hunting videos and if there's a decent amount of support we'll pick a new creek and we'll team up and look for some more treasure Ooh, there. What if we go to a big city? What if we go Ooh. to Atlanta? That's only like an hour and a half away and do this in the middle of the city. We'd find some crazy oh, stuff. Oh, we'd find like stolen cars. We'd probably find like a, <laughs> I don't think like that. a bank robber who like all the money out because he got scared. We're gonna be rich, Jacobson. We're gonna be rich. <laughs> and make sure you guys subscribe to our YouTube channels as well. And Brandon's gonna be uploading his versions today. I'm not Ooh. gonna show you everything Brandon found. So if you wanna check out the stuff he found, it's gonna be make spicy. sure you guys check out his videos. It's gonna be good. Spicy. <laughs> spicy. Right. I don't know Tangy. about it. Ooh, Tangy. exciting. <laughs> I don't know if you guys should watch this video. <laughs> so the first thing we have to do is actually make it up this like little dam right here. It's a little deep in the middle. We have to swim across and then walk up the dam wall. But I think it's going to be really slippery. I think Brandon's going to eat crap a whole bunch. So this should be great. Right. But, uh, <laughs> but I don't think anyone's been here for a while. And I think if we're going to find something crazy, this could be a great place to start. Come on, come on, come on. Ugh. All right. All right, Brandon's going to take the first approach onto the dam wall. I like how we can call it the damn wall. <laughs> Hold on to the wall, Brandon. <laughs> oh my god. I'm scared. The higher I go up, the more I'm going to slide. The further I'm going to slide. Oh! I see the promised land. I made it, brother. Come on, Jake. It's vulnerable. It's vulnerable. Oh. oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, oh God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, I really hurt my butt, dude. Oh, this wetsuit offers no butt protection. <laughs> butt protection. So I don't have a waterproof bag, so I have to be very careful, but I gotta walk up the wall just like Brandon did, put my backpack on his, and then uh I'm gonna slide down for first. <laughs> this is really slippery. I know it's really slippery. I'm not lying, like I can really I'm afraid if I fall, like, my backpack's gonna go in the water. I'll grab you if you fall. Well, maybe I won't, because I got the big camera. <laughs> we'll kind of assess the situation if you like. <laughs> you got it, Jacobson. You can see the promised land. I was slipping way more than you. What the heck? I got those big feet that just, like, plant. <laughs> you look like, long you look like a mime, like, grabbing the wall like that. <laughs> 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 this is your moment, Jacob. This is your moment. Next up, we have Jacobson. Oh! Oh, that is gross. That's actually really fun. I'm gonna laugh so hard when we go like a mile up, it's gonna be like toxic waste <laughs> dump. Oh, I already know it is. <laughs> Jake! Yeah. Five dollar bet. What? I can make it up this on my hands and feet in the middle of no wall. Let's try. Air shake. <laughs> Ready? Let's do it. Here we go. He's Woo! not gonna make it. Next up, Brenda! <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> I'm losing traffic. I'm losing traffic. I get one more try. All right, one more try. Weighing a total of, I don't know what I weigh, but I'm sure it's a total of greatness. Brandon, <laughs> chicken with J -J 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 Jordan. All right, here we go, Jake. Seriously. All right, let's do it. Woo. Woo. <laughs> the hype is real. Oh, we got a different approach this time. Oh. Oh my gosh, you get it really close. So close. <laughs> no! 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 Hey, one more time, here we go. Woo! Hey! Did it! Champion! Champion! Pound for pound! Damn crawling champion of the world. This is like a post-game interview. Uh -huh. All right, ask me a question. What are you shooting for in a career of damn wall climbing? Uh, well, you know, <clears throat> I've been climbing damn walls since, <laughs> you know, since I was in diapers and, you know, the diaper weighs you down, but you know, now I'm in a wetsuit and uh, not even a damn wall can stop me. <laughs> hey, you ready? I'm ready, bro. Let's, Let's go find this. some Let's walk all the way down there. All right, so Brandon and I, we're starting our journey. I see our first bridge, and I'm hoping we find our first object of the day. Oh, oh man. whoa, that's bad. Oh, that's gross. We oh. just found our first piece of treasure. Dang it, man. Wow, got some go. sunglasses. That's what's up. Yeah, it kind of looks like a Ferrari emblem. Got it? Uh, I don't know how I see Wait, this. 
I think oh, it is. is a Ferrari. I emblem. think it is. I oh, thought it was just a, like the river slime on it, but that actually is a oh, Ferrari emblem. Ferrari. It just looked like the slime looked like a Ferrari emblem, but they're actually Ferrari sunglasses, and that's so awesome, man. I've never seen these before in my life, so that's really cool. Do you see this? Oh my gosh. What is that's it? a car door. It's a car. Oh my. God. You just passed this. I was like, what are you? <laughs> that's a car door. That's, look, that's a handle right there. There's the handle. There's the glass. It's like the glass hey, window. Let's flip it over, see if there's anything inside the uh, the side <laughs> pocket. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh my god, it smells so bad. There's a speaker right there. Wow. I'm sure that still works pretty good. Nothing inside the door. Where's the car? Yeah. I bet the car's up there. We gotta oh. find the car. <laughs> <laughs> Brandon got a new car, you guys. Convertible, drop top. So yeah. It was half off too. Crazy. <laughs> How do you think this actually got here though? Dude, I don't know. I don't know, man. Like, they must have just threw it over right here, right? <laughs> like a car That's crash. heavy. What if a car crashed off that bridge oh. and this is just one of the pieces? Maybe. That makes sense. That's cool. That makes sense. Found our first car door. <laughs> Let's find the rest of the car. Now, we've been walking for about 20 minutes and we haven't found anything crazy yet. Oh, Jake, look! What is I that? A basic white girl. A basic white girl. Yeah, look. What is it? Starbucks. Starbucks? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. It's a hotel. It's a Super 8 hotel card. Oh, dude. <laughs> now Check we can go there. Out. We got passes for the Super 8 now. Check it out. Wow. Super 8. I see my first knife. No way. Knife? Yeah. Thank look you. at that. Found my first knife. That's awesome. What kind of knife is this, you think? Oh, that's a little fillet knife. Yeah? Yeah. That's cool. There's just a little bit of rust on this, but pretty cool to find our first knife. I'm gonna use this to take Brandon out later on. Don't tell him that. <laughs> Show me at the <laughs> Super 8 Hotel. <laughs> oh, what's this dude? Is this a Megalodon tooth? Oh my gosh. Look at that. It's actually like a little shovel. <laughs> oh my gosh. That actually kind of does look like a Megalodon tooth. I've seen those videos on YouTube where they're fine. That's awesome. Dude, we are by dogs right now. I know. So we were just walking back there and we saw a dead animal of some sort. It might be like a raccoon or potentially a dog. I'm not going to show you guys, but... It's pretty bad. It smelled bad, it looked bad, and, and all I can remember... You slid head first into the water. I did, and water was on my lips. Oh. <laughs> That's so gross. Oh, yes! Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, yes! Brandon! I cannot believe Whoa. you just found that. I found a scooter. I am so jealous. Oh my god, Jake. What? 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 Jake, there's what? a dead frog by your foot. Oh, there's nasty. A dead frog by your foot. I thought there's a snake or something by me. Oh my god, I can't believe There's dead it. animals everywhere in here. But I got Find a scooter, it, go dude. Go, Jake, go. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> you got to try to let me ride it next. <laughs> I can't believe you found a freaking river scooter. <laughs> <laughs> this is river treasure hunting at its finest right here. I can't believe I found this. <laughs> this is like the best find of the day. See you, Jacob. No. Oh. <laughs> Bye, Jake. <laughs> I'm it's with me. <laughs> we're walking, brother. <laughs> that is that hilarious. Is so cool. This is actually an awesome looking scooter, too. It has some giant wheels. Jake, it was too kind of you to let me borrow your scooter. Yep. I really appreciate it. You're such a good friend, Jake. Yep, you're welcome, man. All right, here we go. <laughs> this is so cool. Dude, that scooter was so much fun. It actually worked out great, too. I can't wait to ride down the dam back there with it. That's gonna be a blast. Look up here, dude. Oh, look at Whoa, that. Whoa, we got our first set of rapids. Pretty sick. I didn't know it did this. So we got our first set of rapids up here, and I think this is gonna be a really good spot for treasure because if anything's going down, it could get stuck right behind this. So I'm excited to get down there and see if we yeah, find some cool stuff, cool. man. So Brandon and I, we actually have to cross this water section right here, but we're sneaking up on all these fish. There's a bunch look, look, look. of them. Oh, look, look, look. Trying to eat. yeah, that was look, look, look. a look. that bass over there trying to eat a fish. To... Oh, oh, dang, that dang. was so cool. So I know it's a little difficult to look on my camera, but oh, Brandon, I think I see something like a phone. What is this, Brandon? There's something shiny right here. What do you guys oh, there's something shiny. I'm about to get it. It looks like a phone. Something shiny? Something shiny. What the oh, heck? it's a buzzer. It's what? It's uh, for your hair, right? Hey, that's what I used to <laughs> cut my hair with. <laughs> that's so cool. I thought it was going to be a phone at first, but it's a hair clipper. Never found one of these before. What the heck, bro? Found nice. 20 bucks. Oh, that's 
Wow. As we're swimming across that area, I actually spotted a $20 bill. Luckiest man alive right here. <laughs> I can't believe I found money in there, Brandon. It's sick, dude. My first initial thought was money, but I wasn't 100% sure, but 20 bucks, dude, <laughs> that's awesome. You know what we should do? What's up? We should spin this at the very end. We should go buy something. Maybe Let's some lottery tickets and some like Gatorade or something. Let's do it. <laughs> Could you imagine if we won the lottery? River oh, 20 bucks that we River found. River treasure hunters find treasure and win lottery. <laughs> That'd be unreal. You would never expect a sewer to be so beautiful. Look at these beautiful oh. flowers, man. They Where did this come good. from? They smell great. <laughs> do they really? Yeah, I'm allergic to pollen. I'd be sneezing the whole time. I probably shouldn't do that. <laughs> Brandon, you're not gonna believe this. I just stepped on the thorn, dude, and it went through my booty. Oh my into gosh. My foot. It's in your foot? Yeah, hold it. Yeah. <laughs> Sit down, man. Here you go. It's actually in my foot a little Ooh. bit. Ooh. Did you get it all out? Yeah, I think so. I'm gonna have to check later, but that was a good one. Oh. That hurt. I bet. Whoa. What are, you, what are these called? Uh, gardening uh, clippers? Yeah, yeah, they're like big clippers. <laughs> Those are big ones, dude. These are huge. You know what this was for? You know somebody was trying to like cut that tree and then they dropped them and they're like, crap. Jake and I were literally just walking and I just happened to look over and I saw like a weird object. I saw this little bit of silver right here. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe you just came across this gun, dude. I just got so lucky. Oh my gosh. So like I found a gun in the river about a year ago and you know, my first initial thought was to hand it over to the police. So I told Brandon, I think that's you know what we should do. We should uh, call the police officers because wow. we don't know, like this could be potentially a murder weapon. Yeah. When Jake and I first came out here, we talked about how we could potentially find weapons or anything that would be thrown into because this is an urban area. We've went all the way through the city. And so if somebody had a murder weapon, this would be a great place to toss it. Uh, but the further we walked, the more we like lost hope. We just saw a bunch of cans, a couple cool things here and there, but no like big ticket items until we came across this. And uh, I mean, it, it just makes sense, man. There's a bridge right behind us where somebody could have thrown it out of their car. Uh, somebody could have thrown it out of a bridge there and it, it, it came to this spot where it became its resting place. Uh, this is just, this is sick. This is so crazy, dude. This is, like, <laughs> this is an this. unreal moment. This has been here for a very long time. It's super rusty. And, you know, I told Brandon, like, if we hand it over to the police, it could solve a case. And I just think that's an awesome story, man. This is such an incredible find. Sick. All the stuff is on it. Super rusty. That's been in there for a very long time. Yeah. So this is definitely my biggest find ever. Uh, we haven't touched the gun yet. It's still in the water. And we're going to do the responsible thing. We're going to call the police, have them come look at it. Uh, guns normally have serial numbers on them, so they'll be able to trace this back to the owner or uh, potentially solve a crime case or maybe even a murder case with this. So this could be a hot pistol, uh, something that was stolen or anything like that. We don't know. So we're going to call the police and have them deal with it appropriately. Uh, but from a treasure hunter standpoint, this is the most unreal find ever. Jake, when you found one, it changed your life. Yeah, it changed my life on YouTube. And yeah, it's, it's, it, it, it was, was insane. It was your first big, big viral moment. I'm not saying that's what's going to happen here, but this is just how special this is. So, uh, this is incredible. So right now I'm gonna go ahead and grab the gun. I'm gonna be very careful because one, we don't know if it's loaded and uh, obviously we don't want it falling apart or anything bad happening in our hands because th I mean, this thing is very, very old. Um, so Jake, I'm gonna hand this over to you and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this guy. Try to keep everything on there. All right, Wow. there we go. Dude, look at that. There's not a bullet in this chamber right here, um, but there, Definitely, uh, potentially, could be some bullets in there. So, wow, that's wow. Oh my gosh, Jake. So very, very cool find. We're being very careful with the handgun. Uh, we're gonna pull up our phone right now and drop a pin at this location. So when we call the police officer, we still have to walk to go meet him. We can't just meet him right here. Yeah. Um, and so we'll bring the handgun with us. So if the officer wants to know where the actual handgun was found. Uh, we can show them that pin in this location because like we said this could potentially help solve a case Potentially a murder weapon. So it's very important that we can tell the officer exactly where this handgun was found So let's go ahead and call the police and uh, we'll handle it from there So I'm actually about to call the Columbus Police Department on Jake's phone and then this phone is uh, I actually have maps up because we've been going through this urban canal So we don't know exactly where we are and this is how we're going to kind of tell the police where we are Otherwise leave a message and we'll get back with you as soon as possible. It is about seven o'clock uh, I guess from this point, we try to call our local police department. Um, I guess from this point to get an actual person dispatched to us, uh, we might have to call 911. Um, it's not an actual emergency, so 
normally uh, you wouldn't call 911, but we call the police department. So, so now I'm gonna go ahead and call 911, uh, and then put them on speaker here. Call Miss 911. Hey, how's it going? This is not an emergency, uh, but I did find a gun in uh, Urban River today, so I wanted to report it and see what we're supposed to do. Okay, where are you right now? Okay, well we'll send an officer down there to you. Okay. Awesome. Thank you so much. You're where? You're welcome. All right, thank you. So we did just see the police officer drive right across this bridge, but I don't think he realized we're in the canal. Yeah, no, he didn't see us. This is the bridge we're supposed to meet him on, and he drove right by. We yelled, but uh, he didn't see us, so I'm going to get up on this, and I'm sure... Hey, brother! Hey, what's going on? How's hey, going, We're the ones who called about the handgun. You guys found it? Yeah, we actually found it right over here in the water. You want me to meet you up here? I'm doing well. Brandon. Nice Brandon. Nice Brandon. Nice Brandon. Yeah. Jake. Jake, nice to meet you. This is the handgun that we uh, Oh, it's found. pretty eroded, huh? Yeah, no, no, no. It's pretty bad. Uh, didn't really get to check it too much. Um, just kind of... Three Bravo 15. Yeah. When we found it, we just kind of left it in the condition and called you guys up. But, I got you. Yeah. Okay. Shoot. That serial number is done. Dang it. All right. Let me just... Uh, Grab your info. Yeah, for sure. So I screenshotted it uh, where we found it just so you guys knew right exactly where it was Hey, that's, that is beautiful. Cool. Awesome. 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 All right. I had a question. Yeah. I know this is a long shot, what? but we're parked like a mile down this thing. Is there any way you could take us there or no? Hey, y'all can hop in. Really? Oh, yeah. nice. Oh, dude, that's yeah. awesome. Are we hopping in the back? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Even better. <laughs> is this your first time, up. Jake? It's my first I'll show time. you how to do it. <laughs> do you want me to put a towel down or anything? No, no, no. Uh, sure? Like I said, I was in the middle of wiping them down, so. Awesome. Have to wipe Come them on, down. Jake. Will you help me? <laughs> Come, Come hang out with me in the cop car, man. <laughs> so basically, I'm showing Jake, you know, what it's like to uh, be a criminal today. <laughs> really, though, how crazy is this? I knew eventually one day we'd be in the back of a cop car together. I just didn't know it'd be like this. <laughs> we did a good deed today, actually. So <laughs> don't judge. <laughs> no judge. So the officer just told us that right where we found the gun, around that location, there was actually an altercation where uh, a male and a female got into an argument, and uh, I guess the female spit in the guy's face, and the guy got really upset, pulled a gun on her, and actually shot her. And so they never found the weapon. Uh, they did detain the guy. Um, in the case is an open public case. Uh, but this could potentially be the gun to that case. All right, we are released, Jake. All right, I'll get our stuff out. Oh, is he letting us go? He's letting us go, Jake. Is For those who don't know, I actually found a gun about a year ago in a yeah. river, and that find changed my life completely. I went from, I think it was 200,000 subscribers on YouTube to about like 1.2 million in crazy. just a couple months. <laughs> and that allowed me to travel and look for treasures and pick up trash all around the world and make cool videos like this as my career. And I want that to happen to Brandon. My video is just gonna be a little simplified edit just because I want him to show off everything. But definitely check out his video, show him some love, subscribe to his channel. He's closing <laughs> in on 500,000 subscribers. You know, Brandon's a great teammate to have and we've had so much fun here in this past couple days down here on the creek. We found some amazing stuff. You're in the back of a- <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs>